A terrifying incident caught on camera in Pasadena. A man with a large knife trying to break into a home. And a woman who was inside was listening and watching as he did it. Tonight, police have issued an alert for this man saying he's done it before. Our Nicole Comstock is live in Pasadena now. Nicole, what a terrifying ordeal. It definitely was, and police say that was not the only home that man showed up at last night. That's exactly why they want to find him. A stranger making slicing motions with a big old kitchen knife. This is what one Pasadena resident found on her front porch Tuesday night. The man opened her screen, and from the inside of her living room, she could see and hear him jiggling the doorknob. I was terrified. It was... Um very frightening. The woman who lives here didn't want her face on camera because of this. He has this huge kitchen knife and what is he going to do with that? By the time her boyfriend ran to the front door, the man was gone. But when they checked their security cameras, they learned he had been out there trying to get in with that knife for about 20 minutes. He had gone in the like a side gate and he had pried off the window screens to um, a side entrance window, um, and then he went around the back and tried to. He did take the screen off of my like bedroom window. He was also caught on camera stabbing that knife into a tree. Thankfully, he didn't get in. But Pasadena police say he tried his luck at several other homes afterward, all near Allen and Corson Streets, just below the 210. And one of the homeowners chased him down. He was found in the backyard, and he was confronted by one of the homeowners who got in their vehicle with uh, another individual that lives there with her. Uh, and then did follow him to an establishment in the city, not that far down the street. Uh, and he was uh, he was hit with a bat by by the homeowner. He might not be coming back to this neighborhood anytime soon, but police say he hasn't turned up in the hospital yet. They're hoping the public can help identify him by his face and the tattoo on his hand that might say 626. For the record, they do not encourage people to take matters into their own hands, especially when they find a man with a knife near their home. They should call the police department and 911 as soon as possible if something like that's taking place so that we can respond and we can take the necessary action. And other neighbors say they think they've seen this same guy from Altadena all the way down to Colorado Boulevard, so they think he gets around this area. Reporting live in Pasadena, I'm Nicole Comstock, KCAL 9 News.